right, so let's see here. Last time we uh, actually unlocked the Lunar Whale. And we also escaped from the underworld um, because the... <clears throat> what's it? We got trapped in Tower of Babel and then... Uh... Wait, I feel like there's supposed to be one more fight before we're going where we're going. Because mm. I could have sworn there was a fight inside the Tower of Babel, like, at the top. Because, again, Goldbest has all the uh, crystals. But, uh... Hmm. Let's see. So, I have two choices. I can take the Lunar Way on the left. Or I can take the Falcon on the right. And, uh kind of explore a little more because I think there's still a couple things I could do here I think it requires the uh, hovercraft so let's uh, grab that it's kind of interesting I forgot that uh, we get multiple <laughs> airships in this game so I think Final Fantasy 7 is the only other one that has like multiple airships like this even then, one of the airships is kind of, um, what you call it? Oh, broken? <laughs> is that a correct uh, word for it? Because um, I did get a rat's tail, so let's uh, figure out where the guy is to give the rat's tail to. Mm, also, there's another side quest where we're supposed to go find all of the um, idolins from uh, the Fey March and that's a side quest with uh, Rydia, yeah okay, it's right there I can't uh, land there. So this should be where the rat tail guy is. Yep. <laughs> it's funny the place is called Adamantite Isle Grotto. That this is a rat tail. Dear boy, he's brought us a rat tail. I've been searching for one of these for ages. Yes, yes, this should do nicely. Well then, what say I give you a bit of this ore in return? A fair trade, I should think. Oh yeah. Hmm. I guess there are multiple rat tails? I don't know. But yeah, with the rat tail, I can actually go back to the underworld and give it to... Uh, the legendary smith. So I do want to reiterate this is not a 100% completion run through. This is more like a uh, kind of replay of the game so I can uh, get to Final Fantasy 7 before the remake comes out. We're in February though, so I'm pretty far behind. <laughs> Especially uh, the other Final Fantasies are gonna take a good time to do. So I definitely probably should uh, step on it. <laughs> oh, I wonder if I can go down there. Oh, I can. Uh, oh, that's not the way back down. Whoops. Oh, that's fine. I think I think I have to put that down before I can land. Otherwise, you'll land on top of the hovercraft. And I don't think I need the hovercraft anymore for the rest of the game. Unless, again, I, there's another uh, rat tail. But I'm not sure. Uh, I forgot which town it is. I think it's this one over here. The legendary smith of somewhere. 
forgot the name of this village. Kakal's Forge. Oh, and this is another uh, dude, dude. I'm getting a sword made for me. It's fine. You love adventures, but watch out for the monsters. No problem. No monster's going to scare me as long as I have that sword. Well, Leviathan's going to get mad at you if you keep putting yourself in harm's way. That's definitely not good. They should go home. Your friend's worried about you. Okay, see you later. Okay, so I think I've taken care of two of them. All right, let's go talk to this dude. This, this is adamantite. If Aja has not robbed me of my wits, I cannot believe it. Allow me to forge that old sword of yours as a token of my most heartfelt appreciation. Relinquish the Mythgraven blade. I wonder what happens if you actually like sell it or threw it away or something like that. <laughs> Could I have still made that? Or maybe it won't allow me to uh, get rid of it. I don't know how long it takes. Is done. The exalted blade Excalibur. It's one legendary weapon. You've given me the greatest gift I could have asked for. The will to continue striving for greater things. All right, Cecil. Excalibur. Whoa, the damage. Again, the only bad thing is. You'll get this defense buff from the defender. Wow, that's a big buff. 10 and then 20. So I guess it really depends if I need to be defending or not. Alright, so that's that. Yeah, part of me wants to actually go around and collect all of the uh, dudes for the uh, kind of Ridia side quest thing. Let's see. I feel like I can, uh, or I found all the ones in the underworld, actually. Nope, I have not. So I found two. Oh. 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 Okay. Uh, I think there's just one more in the underworld I haven't gotten. That is the... Where is this? Might be two in the underworld I haven't gotten yet. I think that's on the moon, right? Oh yeah, it is on the moon. Okay. So I can't get there yet. But I can get the other ones. Okay. So there's actually one in the Doran Castle. Which now I actually remember. Too far up. Uh, supposed to be in the bar area. Getting drunk. <laughs> uh, that's a secret passage, I believe. I believe. Yep. 
Yeah, and this is the bar up here. We should find him in here, I think. Yep. There he is. Everybody's like, ahem. <laughs> oh, I thought we have ourselves a beautiful babe here, but it's just you, Rydia. Here to have a drink, too? No, I heard you haven't come back yet, so I came looking for you. Huh? Is it that time already? These guys are so fu much fun, I guess I lost track of time. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Don't you think you've had enough to drink already? Let's head back now. If you say so, Rydia. I guess I'll go home. I'll go home. So I'm really hoping to finish this game in like five hours max. Because mm, usually the extra ten hours is for side questing and stuff. But I'm not too worried about it as much as I sit here <laughs> going around. But, you know, just the way things are. Okay. There's one in uh, Kaipo, which is the desert world. Though I have to land the f falcon outside on the green, I believe. I could try to land it. Uh, but it won't let me, of course. Don't want it sinking in the sand. So I might have to fight a thing or two. Yep. <laughs> oh, haven't seen one of these. I think all the enemies uh, changed since I last came. Makes sense. Or not. <laughs> Maybe I just never encountered it on the first time. As it, yeah, I <clears throat> haven't encountered one of those. Oh wow. I'm pretty sure I can just auto attack because they're all weak enough, I'm pretty sure. Cross. The cross cures course, which I still don't know what it does, but Okay. And there he is. Oh it's you, Rydia, what a coincidence. I love the water here at this oasis. Been drinking it like crazy. Well you're supposed to be home already. Hmm? Oh no, I totally forgot about that. I better hurry back. Be careful. But those are idolins. They should be able to take care of themselves, I would think. Alright. Alright, one more at the Mount of Ordeals, which is north of here. I think. Yeah. Uh, how far up is it? Maybe I can go from the backside? I really kind of wish I didn't have to fight them all, but... He's in the corner near the save point, so yeah, he should be... Over here, uh, From the uh, back side, I can find him earlier, I would think. That's just so crazy how much damage I do now. Oh, all nines. Pop, pop.
Oh, for no reason. Just hit him. See, I'm pretty sure this is the uh, mountain of ordeals. Let's talk about I went to the wrong mountain. It's actually a possibility I did. I think I did. So I'm thinking back. Oh no. <laughs> yeah, because I'm supposed to go east of Mesidia. So yeah, this is the wrong place. Because this is where I met Yang. And also that mountain is uh, more silver colored. This is like more earth color so let's hopefully I can just teleport out oops and hopefully when I teleport it teleports to the correct side yeah all right yeah keyboard deals is over there on the right side there bottom right It's funny, it's like the same exact uh, enemies. Slap. Seven hundred. So it seems like just yesterday that uh, I ran up this mountain.
Whoa. Crit with the bow. It's crazy. I also see I didn't finish this map, so I'm about to get some items. Talk to him. Hey, video, come to check out the view too? No, I was looking for you. Your friend's worried because you never came back from your ship. <laughs> Is it that time already? I guess this view here made me lose track of time. I'll go straight home. Well, even so. Wait. Oh yeah, there it is. I was like, am I missing a little sliver? Yeah, really already said, uh, I could probably attack him, actually, and still kill him. Uh, really it says the time flow in uh, Fe the Fey March is different than normal, or this realm, I should say. Pop. Still does all nines. <laughs> You know, well, I guess I can't do weakness and critical at the same time, so it just says critical. Oops. Let's get out of here. There's actually one more place that has a uh, an idolin chilling. That is Troya, which I believe is that top left corner. So this is City of Mist, which blew up, or got blown up. City of Troy is over here. It's actually up by the Chocobo Forest. Hopefully I can land here or something. Or not. <laughs> I guess I just had to run through the forest, and hopefully I don't run into anything. I guess it has a bad design, but it's really annoying <laughs> that I have to uh, land over there. No effect. Oh no. <laughs> it's okay. I should be able to one shot with everybody else. Unless Rudy is lacking. Nope. One shotted. There he is. Ah, oh, really? What are you doing here? I came here looking for you. And I, after I heard you never came back from your trip. Time to go home already. Oh, I want to play a little longer. Nope. You better head straight home. Okay. All right, so that is the last one. Let me just check against the levels here. So I finished at level 80, so <laughs> 30 levels to go. But, uh, again, the moon is the next play, so it'll be really easy to level up once the time comes. This should take me back. It's just interesting how the <laughs> world is kind of like loops around like that. But of course, again, flying like this is pretty much like thousands of miles per like square, maybe. So otherwise, it doesn't really uh, scale really well. Yeah, I think there's supposed to be an encounter or a fight that's supposed to happen. Oh. 
It's not against these guys, but... Whip, whip. So I do remember a different boss fight is supposed to happen. Oh, yes. We are now at the Lunar Whale. Equipped with Crisis. Or Crisis. Cryo uh, pods for sleeping. So we get free healing, of course, which is nice. Shows down here. The fat mechanized chocobo. Oh, there is there something I can help you with? I don't think I've ever went down this far to actually see all this. Oh, nice! They actually show what each of them have. In case I wanted to like go back and steal stuff, not like I would, because again, all of this stuff is just stuff we can buy. Oh, you can actually steal silver, or you don't steal it. You, uh, well, I guess you could potentially steal, uh, steal it, the silver apple. But yeah, a lot of these drops aren't that interesting. Ether's always nice. Rainbow pudding. Sure, what rainbow pudding is. I do love how some enemies drop gear, especially if they're not humans or humanoid. It must have, you know, they've got it from uh, killing unlucky adventurers. There's the aether gear. But for some reason, the gear is still like usable. <laughs> More rainbow pudding. Alright, this take too long. <laughs> Cause I, that OCD type, don't want to get rid of all those news. But, that's okay. Let's just not look at it. Oh, I thought the button next to him was something. But nope. Alright. I'm guessing the other options are for post game. Crystal. So this is if I want to fly, I believe. This is if I want to go to the moon. See you, suckers! And we're here at the moon. It's such a scary place to be. This is a definitely smaller map, I'll say that. Ah, Crystal Palace. I can actually find the, uh, it's called the Hemingway Cave or Cove, something. <coughs> it only has, uh, <clears throat> well, Hemingways, but the, uh, bunny ear creatures. I don't think I can, oh, I was like, I don't think I can go down there, but I can't. Okay. Yeah, I forgot the <laughs> theme song of the moon is very creepy. That's also fine we can actually breathe up here, but that's a different story. Alright. I'm not going to talk to anybody. I just want to talk to you. You can get your ass home. Vidya, you really startled me. What are you doing here? Your friend's worried about you. She said you went off on a trip but never came back. Oh, I see. Sorry for all the trouble. I wandered around until I ended up here. It was so much fun singing with the gang here. I guess I just lost track of time. Well, I can see how that could happen, but I know, right? It was so much fun. I have to visit again sometime. Bye, everyone. I also forgot I can uh, resurrect Yang. Because he's uh, alive, but sleeping. 
Oh yeah, think they're all doing that. Yeah. <clears throat> Those NES sounds. We are called Hemingway. Hummingway. Not Hemingway. Because they all like to hum the same tune. Ooh, there's a sparkly spark. Level Lust. What's that? Oh. Have I changed my name again? What do you mean? Oh. Because <laughs> these are not the same Hemingways we uh, met early in the game. Yeah, I forgot I could have uh, resurrected Young. So actually, let's do that now. We can stay in the Lunar Whale. It's not as fast, but it's something. We. So Fabul is top right corner, I believe, because top middle is Stamassi. I forget. <laughs> it's the Edwards uh, Castle. I just remember it was like kind of weird to pronounce. But. Uh, so the trick with getting Yang is talking to his wife. <laughs> just kind of funny, actually. thing I have to remember is how to get to Yang's wife. Well, there's actually a treasure chest over there. I didn't even notice that. I think all this time I didn't really uh, pay attention. Oh. Found it. I didn't really pay attention to the maps like this in the early game. Demon shield. It was too late for the demon shield, I'll tell you that. Let's see, like, how long have we? Oh, crystal room. How long? How much time has passed since the attack on Fabul? I just remember saying one of the wings. East tower. I think it's the wrong side. I'm gonna keep going up just in case. Pretty sure it's the wrong side though. Yep, it's the king side. Queen side's or uh Young's wife is on the other side. I believe on the top floor. There she is. My husband's where? Oh, I can't believe that man. What does he think he's doing lounging about in a place like that? Cry. Of course I'm not crying. I just I just have something in my eye. That lazy good for nothing. Here, give him a good whack on the head with this. Maybe that will knock some sense back into him. <laughs> give me that frying pan. Oh, that's so funny. No, the real question is, do I know... Or remember how to get the twins back. Cause interesting enough, since you know they've been petrified, I have not really had a mage. I have a summoner, and a white mage, but not like a dark mage, black mage. I guess I do have a white mage, Rosa, but I don't have Palum's uh, sick magic skills. I don't think I really need them actually, because I think Rydia does just fine. Alright, let's go ahead and fly this puppy back to... I wonder if I can go in the underworld with this thing. I don't think so, it's probably way too big. Way too big. Too damn big. sake of not wasting time, let's go ahead and switch over. 
guess the one thing I do hate is having to leave the inside of it every time, but that's fine. All right. It sucks because I have to go all the way back through the call it the self cave or whatever forced to get to him I actually don't remember which one's the right one it's not this one that seal cave because I just go to all of them it's okay now this is the one to the Idolans. I remember. And then up here is the one to the Sylph Cave. It's kind of crazy how there's a forest in here, even though it's like all molten lava and everything down here in the underworld. But it could possibly be that they just. Well, you know, Sylphs are usually woodland creatures. And uh, let's go ahead and float everybody. And so maybe they just terraform this inside. To their liking. I mean, that's just a possibility. Back attack. Now we out. We out. We out. We out. This is bad. I think they're all gonna get a chance, yeah, to sing slash do toad. But we're out of here. Does he still have Asuna? Yes, he does. Thank God. Yeah, that's gonna re. Let's uh... try that. <laughs> re explore this whole region. So I didn't finish getting everything. This is a f oh nope, it's real. So it's like a fake uh Oh edge. Itchy. Oh, Rosa too. Yeah, some of these enemies are just so annoying. So I kind of wouldn't mind even those who just do direct damage. Being asleep just makes the whole process slower. empty chest here. I think I remember that part about this place. Marlboro. Six thousand nine hundred twenty four. Ching. Not enough. Not enough cash, stranger. I think I can actually get to the bottom with all these treasure chests. I, mean, I can try. Flow doesn't cost that much, so. Yep, I can't. So let's see where this leads. Let 
Too bad it's not like Pokemon where I can have a uh, repellent <laughs> so I don't have to face random encounters for so many steps. Bomb core. Remedy. Money. More money. Enemy encounter. Back attack. I'm running away. <laughs> See ya. Edge. Stuck. I believe this should actually loop back around to give me another passage. No, I fell into somewhere weird. Shoot. <laughs> I have to go back. I don't think I can go back. It looked like a hole, unfortunately. Okay. The, hmm. Bile. Oops. Oh wow, that's a lot of damage. Mm, the Viathan should do enough damage. Let's kill everything! It's the power of. What you call it? I'm pretty sure I should be able to go left. So it's auto attack. I saw that after I hit it, it knocked it out of its stop. Not like I think I would need to use magic with Cecil, but I have it just in case. Yes! Silver apple. Oh. Where it is? Oh, well, special treasure room. Oh, I still have a uh, float everywhere. It's an ambush! Oh, uh, it's weaklings. Mm, get some Ifrit out here.
Uh, <laughs> I guess all these are gonna be ambushes. Regardless of how good or bad the, uh... I'm pretty sure I can just do this. That should be enough. Uh, they look like they're floating, so I'm not gonna use Titan. Wow. I'm gonna use this instead. White Fang. Because they're just going to give me one of each Fang. And then make me fight all these scumbags. Yes, 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 yes. Oh, yeah, I forgot Edge is like super unlevel compared to everybody. Avenger. Assemble. No, I'm pretty sure I already got a. Uh, let's call it. Uh, Cecil's strongest weapon, Excalibur. I don't think there's anything stronger. <laughs> really is too slow. Medusa arrows. I think I already have some of those too. Uh, at least they're weak. Fang, it's ambush. I really don't think I should care about healing their, uh, what you call it? A silence? Oh, it took me all the way out. That's okay. Okay, <laughs> round two. I guess I have to walk all the way back. Just gotta be careful this time and not fall in the hole. I guess that's what happens when you uh, run around with the map out like this. 
and you don't really look at the surroundings as uh, intently. Because, you know, all I'm looking for is pretty much treasure. Treasure hunting. I really do hate that, uh... I have to keep recasting float every time I, uh... Get into a new room. Okay, those are super weak then. <laughs> yeah, you can roast like and one shot it. That's pretty cool. They're Yoichi Bow. So there's a secret patches way to the right. Uh, yeah. At least float doesn't cost that much and I can cast it to everybody at once. Oh man. Alright. Oh man. I don't think they can just kill it by themselves. <laughs> I love how it's like frog foo. <laughs> ow, ow. At least it only does one damage. So hilarious though. Frog foo. I definitely need to heal all this. Can we walk around as a frog? Now can we? Alright. This time let's try not to jump in the hole. Like there's a space this way. Nope. I'm just seeing things. And now it's a fight. Preemptive strike. Boop. Yeah, radius is way too slow. <laughs> Might as well have it on defense. Defense mode. Oh, I almost did it again. Emergency exit. Oh, there's so many treasure chests over here. Silver apple. Maiden kiss. Ether. Maiden kiss. So I don't really need any of that. Let's go and teleport out and walk away back in. Alright, Yang, we're coming for you. Hope you're ready. No questions, do I remember how to get there really quickly? I appreciate when there's no encounters. I think it is down this way. Tornado. I don't think that's really necessary in this game, especially if it takes forever to cast. Because yeah, sure, maybe it drops it down by heart, large percentage, but 
uh, if it's faster to just kill it out straight, then... Oh, yeah. <laughs> I forgot about that. But, uh... Oops. Say a poison. Uh, <laughs> so let's see if there's a poison little spot down here or not. Oh. For some reason that did not kill everybody, which is kind of surprising, actually. Alright, gang. It's time to wake it the fuck up. What are you doing, you mindless brute? <laughs> what pal? Eh. Is that train time already? Just let me sleep a little longer. What? What's this? Cecil. Young. Thank goodness you're awake. Yes, though I would not even be alive had these kind sylphs not rescued me. Thanks to you, these terrible cannons were destroyed, and now I can go with you again. You mustn't go, not yet, you see. You still need care and rest. I cannot simply sleep the hours away while the fate of the world hangs in the balance. The wounded have no place on the battlefield. And who might you be? Edge of Iblon, your superior replacement. <laughs> Iblon, you say? A ninja, then. But I must go as well. No, no, that would not do at all. Let us go in your stead. Hmm? Oh, okay. This young one is a summoner. This much is that much is plain to see. So let her call us to fight whenever there's a need. Then Yang will have no need to fight, and he can rest right here. Thank you.
Then I will continue to rest. My pardons. There's little I can do to help you know. We can like this. But please, at least allow me to give you something that will. Focus. I believe focus allows you to brace. And then you can... Uh, do like multiple times damage. It's interesting. <laughs> it's kind of funny how again these... Uh, multiple exits lead to the same place but yeah all right so I believe I've pretty much done everything I would want to do on the surface here so let's finally get to the moon and uh, get moving on this uh, story oh lunar whale Actually, I need to recover all my MP from that dungeon just now. Do I remember where am I supposed to go? Okay, so I've been to the Hemingway thing. This is something here. Oh, I can't land down there. Somehow I can land on this little sliver though. And it's kind of interesting, and I guess that's how they programmed it, like depending on the texture of the ground. If it's a certain color, I guess, then I'm able to Oh. Oh. I know exactly where I am. Uh, let's say first <laughs> before I travel too far. I might even have to grind a little bit before I go too far. Oops. Oh, yeah. Yeah, these are like the old ones. I, mean, I believe I can break these dark grenades, so. Yes. Hmm. That's a lot of experience. All right. All right. So I'm gonna try to do the least amount of movement as possible. And I think there are force encounters at certain locations. Oh, I hate this. I hate this girl. She summons. Or doesn't. But I know I can Osmos, and I know I can also break her. But if we just beat her down, then it's whatever. I do, like, no damage, though. Alright, we need to do your thing. Break. Break is such a fun thing to use. Oh, she has Soma drop. Soma's for MP, I believe. Right. Genji gloves. I believe that's for edgy. Edgy. It's purely for defense, but it's fine. I forget there's a easy way to beat some of these characters. So let's put a 
Oh, shit. That's not good. Not good at all. So again, for taking edges, uh, defense thing off. I'm gonna have Rydia break both, and then I'm going to uh, at least attempt to raise edge. Oh, I didn't even pay attention to the uh, percentage thing. Oh, 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 these mages are strong. I, you're gonna have to kill him for us. Oh gosh, <laughs> we almost wiped right there just because I didn't tell uh, Cecil to attack. Oh well, these two girls get a buttload of experience. Yeah, I think I'm gonna have to run around and train a little bit. Oh, let's raise first before I spam heals. Yeah, I was feeling that this encounter actually right across that little bridge. So let's uh, save again, just because I don't waste that little bit of exploration that I just did. And try again. Because there should be a scripted encounter very soon. See the right here? Nope, it's not right here. It's magic though, it's too strong. Oh my Jesus! Alright, we're running. Because <laughs> she's the one doing all the damage, so we gotta get out of here. Damage meaning just breaking her. Everybody. Yeah, might have to grind up a little bit. I probably should grind up a little bit. Because I'm not going to get too far into this layer of the falder. I forget how many levels it is. I should probably Libra it, just so I know. And yeah, next encounter, I'll do that. So yeah, that sorceress is no joke. She didn't gain that much experience, but she just. So, her magic's too strong. Wait, are we missing some? Those are missing 5% of the map there. Oh, she survived somehow, but she is dead. I didn't even get a chance to leap around her. Slowly but surely, we will get enough experience to level up. for that scripted fight. Okay, so she has. Oh, why did I attack her? It's gonna be my undoing. That's okay. <laughs> I use Kira. I need to use the other one, though. Oh, 
Don't know if I remember that they counterattacked. Evans. Right. Yeah, these fights are going to be terrible. I feel like I'm doing this too early, if I'm honest. Genji Ama. I believe it's for, uh, oh, anybody. Uh, you gain evasion, so maybe that's what, uh, oh, you, he loses the crap out of evasion, though. I think I should just give it to, uh, yeah. Oh, thanks for the help, the follow. What's your name? How many? <laughs> How many times? <laughs> That's a funny username. Pretty clever. What? Oh yeah. I should really try to break this maiden first. Yep. Oh. And that moon maiden's, uh. Would be no effect. I said 100%. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it said 100%. Uh. Now Rose is dead, probably. Oh no. Good. Good, good, good. But yeah, that was a uh, pretty BS. The uh, break didn't work for whatever reason. Oops. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't have auto attacked. Oh, it's dead. Never mind. She's running out of magic. Might have to teleport on out pretty soon. Let's see. I'm thinking it's better off that, uh, yep, Cecil gets it. Alright, let's keep moving forward. Okay, so I forget how this fight works. Let's do bio. To protect, because I know I, I think magic was what triggers it actually. So I think I just screwed myself. Yup, no. Yeah, I just screwed myself. Pretty much, you don't want to use magic. You don't want to do anything. <laughs> Alright, we're dead. Dang. <laughs> so I knew that fight was coming, but I forgot how the fight worked. Luckily, I can just continue. So I didn't waste time, really. And I'm just going to teleport out because I'm not ready to fight that thing. At least, I don't think I am. Just going to teleport out. I think I can probably progress a little bit. Because I think there's supposed to be one more thing we do on Earth. But it doesn't trigger until we come here. 
So here we are. It wouldn't hurt to get some sleep. No, it wouldn't. Yeah, my sleep schedule's been uh, very bad as of late. I didn't go to bed till about 4 a.m. almost last night. I was playing StarCraft. StarCraft 2. Right. I don't think there's anywhere else other than like the main story area. Because what I... The dungeon I was trying to complete just now is... Um, it's called the Lair of the Father, but it's pretty much where you get, um, what's it called? Bahamut. Uh, so definitely you gotta be able to traverse that dungeon in order to get to him. As you can see, I'm not ready. I really feel like I should just grind to like level 65 before I go all the way, but... I don't think the black flan has any weakness. I think I just had to beat it straight with magic. Yeah. Uh, let's let Rydia do it. <laughs> that gives no experience. And I got super poison. Poison, poison. Uh, there's a little percentage in the right side. Let me get that real quick. Oh yeah. I forgot I have ninjutsu. Oh, it does it to all of them. Uh, I can just attack it. Yay. Just give me as level, many levels as you can. I'm gonna need them. Golden apple. Enemy ambush. All oh, these things. Oh, paralyze. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Stop attacking Rydia. She's just a girl. They're both girls. Stop attacking the girls. Oh man. I think I can auto attack fast enough to uh, prevent Radio from dying from Sap. Or I guess it would have been a test actually to see if Sap actually kills or if it just leaves at 1 HP. Dragon up in here. No weakness. Oh, I'll stop attacking Rydia. Let's go ahead and cover. Uh, 
Haha. Yes. I believe there's supposed to be like a space worm or something like that. And that's supposed to be the best uh, thing to fight for experience. If I remember correctly. Get the most bang for your time. Ooh, preemptive. Uh, flame. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Thought of the dust. I think the star dust sells for a lot, if I remember. Let's see. Nope, it cast comment. Never mind. Never mind. Oh, I need to heal too. Because those flan like to punch a lot. Punching us. Outside, so let's use a tent and also save. Actually, do I need to use a tent? That's the question. How much MP do I have? I actually have a lot, so let's actually wait on that. Oh. Where am I going? Let's just summon. Uh, I forget if these bombs are also weak against ice. It should be. It should just be a monster trait. No. Uh, I guess because they're on the moon, so it's already cold. It's okay. It still does a buttload of damage. I feel like I just need to buy a bunch of antidotes. Cause everything like poisons. You know, I kind of realized that this moon uh, soundtrack kind of reminds me of uh, Final Fantasy VIII. The uh, pretty much every time you encounter a sorceress, it has like this. Same kind of dreadful uh, soundtrack. Three sirens. I think the sirens are the things that uh, attract monsters. Yep, cause nearby monsters to attack. And I believe in doing so you can attract. Whoa. What are you? Whatever you are, you're weak. Let's go ahead, Freet. Oh, are there five of them? Jeez. I'm pretty sure this is a good mob then. Cause a lot of times, having a lot of easy uh, monsters to kill is better than a big one that's uh, hard to kill. Because they give, like, still pretty good experience.
So I should get a pretty decent experience. Maybe like 8,000. Maybe 7,000. Yeah, definitely don't need to use summon to kill him, but... Oh, 500. Or <laughs> 5,000. Or 6,000. Not too bad. Let's see what the Artemis arrows are. Guess attack. Yeah. Lose a little bit of uh, accuracy, but get the damage in. Oops. way. It's not this way. Okay. Uh... Hopefully this, uh, Thunder's cast is enough to kill it. Yes. Crystal Palace first floor. This is healing. HP and status restored. Look, the other side's MP. I don't know why they didn't just like have it so it healed both match again, life. We just decided to have it separate so we can waste our time. Um, let's actually go out and save because I don't know if there's a boss or something. But yeah, next is the Crystal Palace. Which is the last dungeon in the game, but I could have sworn, yeah, there's something that's supposed to happen. At last, you've arrived. Oh, it's you. I remember you. Who are you? I'm Fusoya, and I'm charged with watching over the slumber of the Lunarians. Fusoya. Lunarians? Yes, we, the people of the moon. Long ago, the world that lay between the Red Planet and the Great Behemoth stood at the verge of destruction, both terrible and complete. The last survivors of that devastation boarded a ship and escaped to the Blue Planet. Blue Planet? The one that you call home. But your planet was still in the midst of its evolution, you see. And so those travelers created a second moon for the planet, and there they settled into a long and quiet slumber. And they're the ones you call the Lunarians. Indeed. But there was one among us who was loath to sleep. He thought it fit that we should simply raise all existing life on the blue planet and claim it as our own. That's horrible. Yes, and so I used my powers to force him into hibernation with the others. But as he slept, his will grew stronger and took on a consciousness of its own. It reached out to men with tainted hearts on your planet, twisting them into beings yet darker still. And through them, he began to gather the crystals. Golbez? So he was manipulating Golbez. Does this guy have a name? His name is Zemus. The crystals function as a source of energy, you see. Oh, the crystals function as a source of energy. I fear he has gathered them in order to activate the interdimensional elevator within the Tower of Babel. With it, he will be able to transport the giant of Babel to your planet and use it to extinguish all life there. Oh no, but do not be, be mistaken. His will is not that of all we Lunarians. The rest of us have been waiting quietly for your planet's people to progress to such a point that we might treat with one another as equals. We but wait in sleep, dreaming of that day. And the lunar whale, where did it come from? Ah, the ship. My younger brother, Kluya, built that vessel long ago and flew it to the blue planet. He took with him several of our secrets, such as the ones employed in your Devil's Road in, in airships, a gift to your people. Cleo was fascinated by your planet and wished to know more of it. And while he was there, he fell in love with the woman of your planet. She later bore him two children. One of them was you. <gasps> the revelations. What? Me? Then that voice I heard at Mount Ordeals. 
was the spirit of your father or was the spirit of your father indeed you are the very image of Kluya in his youth so it was my father he vested you with his power so that you might prevent Zemus's plot from coming to fruition Zemus must be destroyed for your planet's sake and for that of my people as well we must hurry to Tower Babel near Eblon the tower is protected by some sort of barrier now there's no way in I should be able to bypass the barrier we must not let the giant of Babel be unleashed upon your world. Yay. So this is like a super sage, I believe. Because before we had Tella, then he sacked himself. But um, now we have Fasolia, level 50. And I believe he's able to cast uh, good amounts of magic. So our party is full once more. Though it's uh, another caster, so let's actually change the party around. Uh, pretty much you only want two in the back row. Or front row, I should say. Oops, I had it right. Okay. There you go. So now Edge and Seesaw are both front, and all the casters are in the back. And if you didn't know, in Final Fantasy, the row system is front row takes full damage, back row you get like a bonus defense for some reason. I, I still don't really super understand why that's the case, but I'm not going to argue with it, so we will take it. Oh yeah, Bless is like a stronger version of... Uh, Prayer. I think. So we'll see in a second. Oh no! Oh yes! <laughs> I think that, yeah, it takes away our experience, unfortunately. Yeah. Oh, so he's like a super white mage, actually. But he, he is able to cast Holy, which is nice. He only casts it three times, though, unfortunately. So let's actually save his... Oops. I meant to use this. His magic. Alright. Just gonna have this long trek back to the Lunar Whale. Yeah, such a creepy tune. I feel like Bless only does MP and not HP as well, so Prayer might be better overall. Oh, I should actually have waited and let the sap potentially kill, because I still don't know if sap kills or just leaves them at 1 HP. I just never think of it until it's too late. Back attack. Okay, so Bless is like a regen for mana. I see, I see. So as if the battle goes on long though, but I'm just like nearly two shotting or two rounding everything.
I am missing a pixel somewhere. Do I see it? Maybe it's just on the way out. What? Oh, Blitz only does uh, one enemy? Oh, not that it matters since they, uh... No, it should hit all of them. Yeah, whatever. Just attack. Attack! I'm not sure where that last pixel is. Probably should have saved, actually. That's okay. Back to Earth. Uh-oh. What's going on? It's the Tower of Babel. We are too late. What? The giant has come. No. <laughs> he like grabs his cape. This can't be happening. Isn't there anything we can do? What's that? Oh yeah. Dwarves, we fight for the earth, our home, and the mother of us all. Lolly ho. Yang, you should not be out here. You push yourself too hard. I wonder what happens if I never saw Yang, if he actually appears here. I'm fine, and even were I not, this is not, this is no time to be lounging in bed. Oh, Sid too. Nothing to worry about now. Sid's here to help. All engines, full power. Sir. Hey, hey, did you miss me? Oh. Our elder lifted the spell on us somehow. <laughs> Steven Teller can do it. This is not your burden to bear alone. This is a battle for all we live, for all who live and breathe upon this planet. Edward as well. 
see so let me show you the courage you helped me find so I guess even if we didn't see what happened to Yang he was so appeared I'm pretty sure they all came to fight the giant it staggered gotta get up in this head then this is our chance we can get inside the cursed thing right then we can slice up whoever controls it from the inside we're going to need your help Sid take us to the giant's mouth yeah, who's this old white haired thing he is ordering me about his name is Fusoya he's from the moon the moon we've no time can you get us near enough to jump can fish swim <laughs> Who do you think you're talking to? Jeez, good thing I saved. No, I'm pretty sure I can save on the inside, but yeah, it's pretty funny. But yeah, this is the uh, encounter I was talking about. That I'm pretty sure this was gonna happen before I finished the game. Well then, best hold on tight. Look at his lips. The lips. Now's our chance. But maybe that's why we weren't that strong. Because uh, there's still this little dungeon left to do. I'm pretty sure we still encounter things. Yeah, it's a whole different tendo. Or dungeon. Giant's neck. Three X potions. Yeah, explosion in this game is not as strong as in future games. This game only heals uh, 1,000 HP. In uh, later games, it heals all HP. Which is incredible. Actually, I believe I can use Blitz. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. I'm gonna go off on a whim and do that. Go ahead and heal everybody. Uh oh. Probably use Ruma. Use some more Blitz. Use so much experience or not experience magic. Oh wow, these things are strong as crap. This is definitely time to use uh bless. Alright, finish him. Bam. That was not enough to kill that one. Ah, I miss. How could you miss? Thing is kicking my ass. Maybe we get a buttload of experience for this. Oh, I forget that uh, her whip has electric damage. Oh, yeah, that's pretty good. Fuma Shuruken. I need to start using them. Maybe I'll use it on the boss in this. Dungeon. Back attack. I feel like I should just defend and let the casters do all the damage. Oh, 
or not. Nah. Just wanna heal some uh, magic right here. You know, I'm like taking a beating. We're taking a beating. <laughs> yeah. High potion. Ether. Counter. Yay. Oh no. Oh, uh, <laughs> it's funny how he turns into Paper Mario status. It's like straight flattened out. So funny. <laughs> Back in the game. <laughs> that rise is funny. Maybe just. Because the rise, it fully recovers you, so normally you use raise or phoenix down, and that only reses you but heals you for like a couple hundred HP. But using a rise fully heals them, and so they're like, I'm back at the game. It's like, <laughs> pretty much like a sensu bean sort of thing. Oh. Let's see that chest over there, there's a chest right here. Siren. I feel like I should just grind in this area. Because the enemies aren't that bad. Could just AoE thunder everybody. And then, uh. Yoichi arrows. So I can probably gain like three or four levels. I could probably gain more if I wanted to. What? It's like the same enemies every time. Every encounter takes so much damage on me. I wonder if the enemies on the moon get stronger when we come back. Because I think that first time on the moon was just to like... You know, still placate to our lower levels, but after this dungeon... be able to second alarm everybody you do not know what that guy does he seems pretty strong though oh, beam's pretty strong too oh they're all weak against electricity he also has 999 HP. Pretty aren't answered. They have less already.
Yes. Silver apple. I have all these apples and drops that uh, in full, uh, permanently increase HP and MP, but I'm not quite sure who to use them on, so I just hold on to it. Uh, I think I might have to use this twice. I think I'm also need to heal myself. Ah, oh, oh, <laughs> dang it. We can't do it fast enough. I feel like I should equip the defender for defense. Right, that should kill everybody. Nice. I guess Fusoya and Edge can catch up a little. Ah. Oh. Oh yeah, I forgot. Fusoya is capped out at his, uh, his current stats. Which of course tells us that uh, he's very temporary. That's fine. That's just how the game is. So you will lay your hands off a video. Too bad uh, Cecil's getting beamed to death over here. That's okay though. We should be done and done. Yeah, I really think I should put the defender on right now. Yes. Because he should be more in a defensive role. Because he's a knight, meaning paladin. Uh, defender. Yeah, that's a big increase. And of course, a big decrease, but. Still, probably good damage. <laughs> you know if I go first, they still get to move first. Oh. <laughs> See, the defender's working already. Oh wow, that did not kill him. I think I used Blitz. Oh jeez. Uh oh. <laughs> so can I kill the beam cannon? Nope. It's okay. Oh, Friosa. Fusoya. <laughs> oh well, they're dead now. Well, at least the cannon is. Yes, okay. So yeah, Fusoya doesn't really need any levels because he's not gonna go anywhere. Flare, yes. Yeah, I spam regular cure instead of like higher level cures because regular cure only costs three. I can heal everybody with it. At the same time, I think Kura uses either 8 or 10 magic. 
Uh, I guess I could check it, but I feel like it's better just to cast regular cure. Conserves a uh, mana. Uh, there's chests in the middle there. Yeah, I'm gonna heal. So you ain't do nothing else. Cecil, finish him. Oh, it's our friend Hemingway up there, or Namingway, or whatever way <laughs> his name is. Uh oh, I don't like this. Don't like this one bit. I'm Libra it. See what you're weak against. Still electricity. Uh, let's hit you with some bio first. Hit you with bio first, and then I'm going to unleash the electricity upon ye. Scorch. It's not gonna steal anything. He does have black magic. He has meteor. Let's see if I can osmos from this guy. Couldn't steal. I didn't realize he had black magic. So I, so I knew I could have sworn he was a... Uh, nope, can't. He was a sage, but... I can only see his white magic abilities. Oh wow, that did a lot of damage. Still couldn't steal. Well then, we're just done. I should get a couple grand for that. Ooh, 10,000. That was a fairly easy fight. Of course, I guess the Scorch thing is supposed to be what uh, scares us the most, but... Good thing I switched to Defender, I guess, and just everybody is uh, strong enough to withstand the Scorch Onslaught. Uh, I should have, uh... I did a Ninjutsu. Ouch. Oh, it's random black. Oh, it's my controller. <laughs> it's unplugged a little bit. Nice. Yeah, I never really use uh, edges ninjutsu that much. Oh, that's the way out. Welcome! We use a shop this time. Bomb crank. Let's get some heavenly rafts. I don't think I need too many, but honestly, I guess I don't need any at all, but. No, I wonder if you can throw like these using um, Edge's throw ability. Ah. Uh, Oh, it's two of them. That's scary. It's a sh shell and protect, and oh, we have some dead people. Okay. Uh, I'm scared. 
I'm scared. Is my phoenix down? Did I pass it? There it is. Alright, we're getting out of here. Wow. Well, me if I do die. Which I didn't, but if I did, I just hit continue and be fine. That was some BS though, that's for sure. Alright, we're using a cottage. We're using a cottage. I believe. I really wish I could have, you know, fought through that double blue dragon. But I uh, just couldn't get anything off. Anyways, let's go ahead and move forward. Alright. Wait, oh, yeah, don't I fight? Oh. Wait. Okay. I was gonna say, didn't we kill them all? But you can. It's the rematch of the century. the cottage but I don't have jump anymore though oh no okay at least we find a one by one but uh, I believe I can just use holy on this fool or fire ouch why? Oh, he is not weak against holy. He is weak against flame. Meaning fire. It's also a shell. Uh, let us haste somebody. Probably Redia. Oh, shit. He is not actually weak against Holy. Against ice, right? He doesn't have ice. I'll just use blitz. What if Asuna heals uh, slow? Because we'll find out in a second. Ouch. Hmm, where is haste? And yeah, Fusoya can also cast haste, actually. Let's mm, cast it on myself. Yes. We're using Blitz. Ah, oh, Jesus. 
like I see it, and you're supposed to counter with uh, electric attack, but then it doesn't happen fast enough, so it's like, why bother? And it's definitely a magic attack, but that's stupid. It's because, again, it's on active instead of wait, probably. Oh, this way it heals. Oops. Alright, let's try this again. Chink Mirage. Okay. And you're dead. Mm. Jesus. Why you be dumb for? Uh, dang. Get you to do a rise as well. I already have protect. I need to jump, but I have no one to jump. I don't remember what she's weak against, actually. Let's just use Leviathan. Wait, what do you do? Okay. We can throw. Da! <laughs> I cannot even throw. Then I guess. Right, where's Esna? She's gold needle. Prayer unanswered. <laughs> Throw the Excalibur, oh no. Hopefully I don't do that on accident. They do have Shell on, but... Do it. Do it. Wait, where are you? What? He has hurt himself. He's about to kill everybody, though. Oh, shit! <laughs> After all that, 
gonna wipe me with one inferno. Seriously. Seriously. That's BS. Alright, let's make sure I can't do anything else. Yeah, I don't think I can... Everyone's at, like, or has their max stuff on. Because I can just go straight DPS then. Uh, I guess I should really do magic. Because I'm not attacking, so. I probably should go back and heal too. It's not enough to warrant changing to it. Alright, let's actually go back and save this configuration. Maybe I should just slow the battle speed down. That, that'll probably help. Uh, put it there, there. Save. Let's try again. That was baloney. But now I think about it, I just get more damage. That's fine. All right, skip all this. Dun, 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 dun. You again. You again. So pretty much the main idea is to keep Rydia alive. She's the main damage dealer with her summons. Um, yeah, Rosa and whatever will heal. Oh, I also need to slow Rubicante. And I don't know how much damage he did when he did uh, Inferno. I wasn't really paying attention. But I'm pretty sure it was like 2k to everybody at least. Um, and I'm pretty sure Fusoya is like for certain gonna die from it. Because his HP is like stuck at that amount. But, alright. If anything, it's like an RNG battle. Um, flame. Do shell protect. And let's just do Ifrit. Let's get some bless up in here. Jeez. What if throw is uh for sure gonna hit? That's a good question. All right. Well, I guess I'm blind. Makes sense. So I'm pretty sure after this he will be dead. Uh, let's go ahead and get haste onto Rydia. Oh no, forgot about this. Dang it. Well, at least I'm hasting uh, Rydia. I guess I should haste everybody else. At least those who need it. Mm, what are we doing? Haste. 
Feast on her. Let's just make sure it cancels out. Cause I don't want to get hit by the that. Blasted apart by lightning. That's pretty cool. I think I need to put the blessing back on. Oh no. That's so much BS. BS, bro. I think one more should do it. I should really hit somebody with Meteor, see how much damage that does. Jeez, I'm so slow. I should make you slow too. Nope, we're just slow together. And of course, Fusuya takes it in the ass. Wow. That sucks. <clears throat> so Suna does not counter haste, or at least gets rid of it. So I pretty much only want to use magic attacks. Let's use. Oh, dang it. Oh, dang it. Hopefully, Fusilla arises a different character. Dang it. Dang it. Alright, this is bad. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Even on a slower battle uh, speed, I'm like messing up. It's not good. Res as many people as possible. Can't believe I'm gonna die on this lady. So slow. Yep, there it is. Dang it! That was terrible. Terrible because I slowed it down and still messed up. But it's because I rose the wrong people and wasted uh, healing turns. Nice, right, just do it again. Many 
I got this. Yeah, it's pretty much just got a DPS and heal. Don't even worry about like speed. If anything, maybe I just don't attack, attack, just uh, cast. I think uh, attacking straight causes Curse Elegy, or maybe if he gets to a certain HP threshold, he'll counter with it. That's pr that makes more sense, actually. Oh man. Curse Elegy. Oh, gas. What does gas do? Oh, it's supposed to be asleep. Oh, also silence. That is no bueno. But good thing uh, Rosa didn't get silenced. Actually, I can bless though. It's just all RNG because before I never had to deal with uh, the gas portion till now. I really need to slow these bosses down as well now that I think about it. Really, how summons do that? Like, totally messes up my. Dang, he just gassed me again. Oh, curses. Slow this fool. What if I should berser can I berserk him? I don't even know if that's a good idea, but I'm gonna try. Cause then he can't do his like BS stuff. Nope. Oh no. Oh well. Looked like it missed. Maybe I should also put it on weight. Absorbing 
ice now because he's doing that. That sucks. It's okay. That kind of doesn't make sense. And for some reason, the, the electricity didn't uh, bust through the uh, thingamabob. I'm so confused. It's okay. Doing it again. Dang it! <laughs> Why you do it twice in a row? Excuse me? Why'd you miss? I got you this time. Let's buy all this dude, actually. Not like, uh... Much time's gonna progress before stuff happens, but... Any extra amount of damage is good. Again? Can I throw you? No, I couldn't. Jesus, I'm like wasting so much. Uh, so many summons on this dude because he keeps doing the same water surge before uh, Shiva can do her thing. I only did 100 or something. I keep trying. I don't think I need Kieran. No, I don't. I should really like leave a character ready just in case I need to throw a thing with Bob at it. Too. Actually, in his heel. God damn it, Rydia. I think there is a way to. Oh, Edge died straight up. I was say, there should be a way to just turn off the summoning thing so it doesn't do that. I want to say also Ashra does what? Um, cast Barrier and stuff like that. Okay, damn it. I'm being dumb again. Where's Kane when you need him? Busy being a traitor. Too bad using wind attack doesn't knock her out of there. Not like it matters. Alright, let's slow this fool down. Slow him down. 
slow his roll. I'm just gonna keep trying to heal myself. In the off case he does a freaking inferno or something stupid. That's something stupid. It's not that bad. Ooh, all nines. We get one more. Uh, Leviathan cast on him. That should do it. That's about 20,000. Each Rukins! Yeah, yes. Okay. Oh, Fusuya has been stoned, dude. I did not realize that. That's not good. Don't hit me with Inferno, please. No! That wipes me. Oh, not totally. That's still bad. So bad. He's gonna hit me one more time and I'm gonna be dead. Okay, cool. You had mercy. Mercy. Yeah. This is a good time to just get my shit together. Ouch! <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> Seriously? Just one shot him. Okay, Rydia, I believe in you. I believe. I believe. Yes. Yes. <laughs> I wonder if that fight's even possible without Leviathan. Because, Lord Jesus. Stupid. Oh, look at all the experience that. Is wasted on Fusoya because he doesn't literally level up. Lord Zemus, we failed you because we're trash. Not again. A sound and thorough defeat. At least I know I was high enough level to actually beat him. And again, it's all uh, RNG, like, he could have just infernoed me twice, and I would have been dead. I'm surprised I survived the one inferno. But, yep. Let's go ahead and use a... I think I'm good with just a regular uh, tent, actually. So I did use a lot of magic, but then I also had a blessing going on. So... I think this should be good enough to replenish what I need. Okay. Alright. Let me finally move forward. That was a uh, pretty significant setback for sure. Good thing I'm not speedrunning this game because way well, hey, out of. Definitely already <laughs> failed that portion of speedrunning. Just off the beginning, grinding and stuff. Alright. Of course, it's back to back bosses. This now controls the giant's operational systems. It's huge! You must find the defense. We must destroy the defense node first, or it will repair damage to the core. So it already tells us pretty much the tactic. We want to kill the defense core first. Which one? Oh, this one. Laser barrage. Okay, <laughs> is that gonna wipe me? Because that's just BS every time. All right. I think let's just use Leviathan the whole time. I do not remember which one I used. 
uh, shell protect. I think I'd use shell, but I don't want protect, I think. Nope. So I did do protect. But yeah. Kill the defense node. Then attack the center. So I think I can leave the attack node up. It's whatever. It's like a boss rush almost. Because I think it's even worse if you destroy both nodes attack and defense. Shit. Shit. Oh. It is actually... It actually absorbs water. Now I think I'm dead. Because for some reason, they couldn't heal fast enough. Oh, jeez. It's going to be that kind of fight. <laughs> <laughs> it's that kind of fight. Oh, jeez. <laughs> so, I guess I should have known it was going to be a tough one because uh, I'm gonna, I barely beat the elemental archfiends, let alone beat this. Let's try not to heal the uh, defense node. Let's actually slow the attack node, if possible. And I know I still kept the, uh... Time, or not... Time, but the uh, battle speed low. Par oh, Jesus. Somebody dead again. Honestly, I think I'm just going to have to fight, like, grind. Because not being able to tank two in a row like that, it's already be it. Oh, wow. This asshole absorbs uh, holy damage. Okay. <sighs> Alright, so let's grind a little bit because. Yeah, I can't even withstand two shots of the laser barrage. So this is a slow part of the stream. Not like the whole exploring thing at the beginning wasn't slow either, but... Uh, how annoying. these things as fast as possible. Try to gain like three or four levels. Probably be perfect. Wow. I used two scorches before I was able to do anything else. So he's so weak. It's a waste of a character. It's funny because you think that they give you somebody that's like on par with what's going on, but no, he just has healing magic. As if uh, two healers weren't enough, just have a third one. See, so again is he's a hybrid. He does both attack and defense. Yeah, honestly, I don't remember this portion being this hard. I think I just need to level up to like 65, and that should be okay, maybe even 70, but I don't know how long that'll take. 
Because I'm not gaining like tens of thousands of uh, experience every battle. If anything, the big test will probably be uh, being able to withstand fighting to the dragons. But I don't know if or when I will encounter that again. Oh, I spoke too soon. Okay, so we're just going to be healing like crazy. Because these guys don't mess around. About to eat another scorch, yep. <clears throat> At least I can withstand two sh uh, scorches. I remember the first time I fought these things, scorches like totally destroyed me. But yeah, we're in full defense mode now, and Vidia can do all her. Uh, Uh, summonings. Hmm. Finish him. So that's about 20k, which is pretty nice. Yes. Just give me all this juicy experience. Like as fast as possible, but then I end up. Yep, the same thing just happened. Because I press right to select everybody, but then sometimes it like. Uh, I guess if you hold it, it counts as it's you pressing it multiple times. Um. And so yeah, just pull it down too much and uh kind of go opposite of what you want to do, just kind of dumb. And the goal is just keep Rydia alive and she can do all the damage we need. I think I can just use Thundaga on this guy. Should be done. Yeah, just keep giving me these double dragon encounters. We'll be leveled up in no time. <laughs> Envy Soya yeah, is just a waste. What's the point of you if you don't even gain attributes? Ugh. Like I says, the uh. The definition of stagnant when you reach a certain peak and then you can't do anything else. Yeah, these encounters ain't aren't too bad, but they're just slow because we had to wait for everyone to attack and stiff. Wow. Why you gotta pick on uh Rosa for?
<laughs> beat down before Rydia can even cast her thing. Maybe I should just cast haste on Rydia every time. It's just a waste though. Oh, I got a tent. Let's use a tent. It's really, uh, again, it's using buttload of magic every time. Let's try using a siren, just to see if I um, get an increased encounter of the uh, double dragons. A uh, single dragon's fine too. I kind of forget that uh, Rosa does pretty good damage, actually. Yeah, I think uh, we get to kill it before Rydia even gets to do anything. Yep. Maybe I should do that for the double dragon, just like DPS one of them down and then heal. My target's like 62, 63 in that range. Then I'll move forward. I don't know what the lowest level you can be to beat the game. Surprised. Ouch. Ouch. Honestly, I feel like I just keep Fusoya dead. So I can increase my uh, experience intake for the rest of the characters. Oh wow, neither of them died. Oh, because one of them has like 43 HP left. What a waste. If I can try that next time Fusoya goes down, just leave him down. I'm not sure if that's a good thing because of a... Uh, you're gonna lose a healing guy and... Especially the double dragons, they do pretty good AoE damage, so... We need to AoE heal to counter. <laughs> Should be enough for Radia to finish. If she gets to actually it's a <laughs> summon. Yeah. Let me use Rowan one siren to see what comes out. It's at the bottom? No. Oh yeah, it's at the bottom. Oh, who the hell are you? I do not know who or what you are. Probably still weak against electricity though. Alright. Electricity, right? Yes. It's a single target, so let's just do this. Thunderga. See if I can steal something nice. The thing has like 
what, 22,000 experience? Or, uh, HP? So I might be here for quite a bit. I should probably cast Protect, actually. Uh-oh. I don't know what that is was. But I didn't do that much damage, so we're good. I didn't see how much damage that did, but it did quite a bit. Okay, I think I can just auto-attack for most of it. It's not doing as much damage to me as I thought it would, so that's good. <laughs> Alright. Go and defend. Oh! <laughs> of course, it like, bypasses the two front defenders and just hits Rydia in the back row. Alright. How much uh, experience am I getting for this? Quite a bit. Not bad. Oh, yeah, I forgot, I should be casting haste on Rydia instead of just wasting time. She's running low on MP again, but we have plenty of cottages, and then this guy sells cottages as well, so it's not that bad. The only bad thing is grinding through these levels. Thunder. Maybe it's better to slow instead of haste. So I believe I can slow multiple, so maybe that might be a better choice than hasting. Ah, good old Fasoya being a waste of space. So I can technically cast uh, Ruma Summon five more times. Uh, of course they're targeting Rydia because they're scumbags. And of course they kill Rydia because they're scumbags. Just gotta beat them down the old fashioned way. Beam's too strong, man. Too strong. Sorry, Rosa. You got killed. 
Kataj. Oh, everyone's kind of close to the target. Let's get edge to like 61. And that uh, should be hopefully enough to at least challenge the boss again. Dragon. Oh, I can just do. I'm pretty sure it's definitely better for it to not attack fast enough instead of being able to attack twice, really. Oh, yeah. Or if anything, <laughs> let's just kill it straight, not even wait for Radio to attack because she takes too long. Look at that. Honestly, I kind of just want to do like one more level, or like get edge to 60. Oh jeez, 25,000 for the next level for edge. And again, we've already been on the moon, so we've seen like HP, or not HP, but XP growth, or yield is a better term. I think the one I want to uh, level up is dead. And the other ones just have like barely any HP. If I can level up to the point where I can tank like two laser barrages in a row, that should be okay. Oh yeah, it's going. Oh fuck, I did it again! Shit. So there's a good chance I'm gonna get scorched to death now, because. My. Yep. Well, Soya's gonna go down at least. Should be able to heal. One dragon should die. And hopefully Rosa can get her heal off. Yes. Fusoya can stay down because he's going to waste of a experience allocation. I think I just auto attack it to death now. <laughs> Mr. Paper Fusoya. Nah, 27,000. That's all it takes. Just one party member to go down. Alright, let's do a couple more since uh, Fusoya's down. I wonder if I should have been keeping Fusoya down so I can level up a lot faster. Uh... Oof, 91,000 though. I mean, if I'm making 20k, give or take. More than 20k from those double dragons, and I should be. Oh, jeez. Back attack. Back attack! It's 
Stop missing, man. Stop missing, women. Men, woman, child. Taking the damage unnecessarily because you're missing. Well, I guess I would have taken that damage anyways. But just don't miss, please. Don't miss. Yeah, I think that uh, enemy formation usually gives about 7,000 experience. So what Fasoya did, it gave me like 80 something, 100. Alright, a couple more fights should do it. Whew. Eh. <laughs> it's like it headbutts me. Kind of funny. See, so if all these other moves, but you're just gonna headbutt me. Yeah, I think I'm gonna auto attack it to death before it Rydia can cast. Yeah, she's so slow. Let's actually put a uh, Rosa on the top. Fusoya is kind of useless, especially now that he's uh, KO'd at the moment. I res him for the fight, obviously, but for this training purposes, I'm not going to. <clears throat> he doesn't gain any uh, stats, so that's why. Why bother? I'm starting to think maybe I should just auto attack myself with Rydia. Yeah, look at Fasoya, he's like disappeared. It's just his clothes. Kind of creepy, actually. Oh, yeah. I moved her up there for this purpose, so I don't have to scroll down every time. I already forgot. Okay. Just get edge to level 60, and then uh, we can try it. And if I feel like I need to train some more, then I'll train some more. Uh, stop being surprised and stuff. Cast it. Cast it. more now. About halfway there. I mean, these double dragons, that's all they really need to fight. And I'll get there really quick. They're a pain, but as long as I can kill them, that's all that matters. What about <laughs> what did I tell you about missing your targets? Can't do it. Just can't do it. Nice. Yeah, it's funny. Like once you get used to something, and then trying to like change. And like your habits and stuff, <laughs> it's really difficult because you're too used to do, uh, just doing the stuff the other way. And I'm mainly talking about me switching <laughs> just the party order to have Rosa on top. So my brain's already like, oh, you, she's on the bottom. <laughs> so scroll down there. But that is not the case. Oh, Cecil leveled up. 
to Iridia. It's the edge to do the same. I feel like I can probably beat the game in like level 70-ish, 70 70-something. 70 I hit Rosa. Oh, never mind. I thought I swapped Rosa already. Oh, don't hit Sissel. He's almost dead. Just summon. Summon, girl. Summon. Summon. Alright. We get even more experience now that Cecil went down. Should be like one or two more battles. Yep. Two battles tops. Especially if it's the dragon. For one of them, I mean. Speak of the dragon. Eh. <laughs> I think after this area, I'll probably try to go to the Lair of the Father again, once I get back to the moon. Yeah, that's an interesting twist, especially if, you know, for those who haven't played it before, that, um, again, Kane and even Golbez himself aren't really evil, they're just being manipulated by some spirit do thing. <laughs> on the moon and so all this that has been going on is only because of uh, extraterrestrial forces causing it to happen but we will see soon enough how it all plays out So that's level 60, so I'm going to go ahead and use another cottage. And that didn't even like help towards, I guess, defending against Old oh, Frost. Defending against uh, this future laser beams we're about to get hit in the face with. Let's go ahead and use cottage. here in a counter force so let us try this boss again again the key is just not dying into the laser barrages because that's just stupid and yeah a lot of it's just defense and I don't think I really have anything that will boost the defense enough to get us to where we need to go or need to be, I should say. Alright. Maybe I should have turned the speed down even further. Change it on uh, active, or wait, I mean. Oh my gosh. <laughs> that was like sticky. Like, I was pressing the confirm button, but it wasn't doing anything. Alright. So I believe that was one laser barrage, and looks like that's... I'm not going to have enough for two laser barrages. Like, defense against it, I mean. <laughs> Here's the second one. Yep. God damn it. Like, how's this possible? Pretty much I can't buff myself if this is the case. 
Because I don't have time to buff myself, because this thing keeps doing laser barrages. Hmm. I'm gonna try again, but... I think either for Soya or Rosa has to consistently do healing. Like, just non-stop. And that's all they're going to do. Hmm. I guess Edge can also somewhat buff by putting a uh, Hermes sandals. Hermes sandals on uh, somebody. <laughs> somebody meaning Rydia. Swear your sandals. On myself? I don't put on myself. Why can't you throw on somebody else's? <laughs> I don't understand. Okay. Okay. Mm, so we pretty much have a waste of space then. Is that what you're telling us? Yeah, I'm not stop casting, uh... Here we go. That's just so stupid. Okay, so maybe it's uh strong against all sorts of um what you call it? elements. Oh yeah, I should have taken sword off thing. I'm gonna find one of the elements that it is okay against that anyways because the defense node on the right seems to be absorbing all sorts of elements of course I can't have that be going down and then of course holy is one of them I wonder if I should just uh, attack the attack node I can slow the attack node Nope. Okay, that's good. It'll probably eventually resurrect it. I believe the defense. That's what the defense node does. I'm not 100% sure, but I feel like that is the case. Dang it! Sorry, Edge. Let's attack the CPU. Let's use the light and so maybe this might be the better yeah what am I talking about what was I uh, focusing on the defense node for it is healing it but it's not healing it enough to really matter where's the dispel at dang where did you do it again I'm trying to like find where dispel is there it is I'm so dumb. Oh yeah. <laughs> and that's why we don't care about uh, Reflect. So yeah, I think I believe... Yeah, yeah, I'm so stupid. Pretty much you just want to keep spamming summon. That is the goal of this fight. AKA kill um, the attack node so it stops laser barraging you. Do not kill the defense node because it's not again strong enough to really heal fast enough against your uh, Leviathan or whatever you're summoning or whatnot. Uh, and it doesn't resurrect the uh, attack node unless I believe you've destroyed both nodes. Then it will, uh, what should we call it? It will resurrect it, but yeah, oh, okay. Without DPS, yeah, I was just being stupid. <laughs> so the real boss is actually the attack node, and then making sure you don't destroy the defense node, which of course I can't because, uh, 
all these summons do healing to the defense node. So that is the secret to this boss. Uh, don't know if I have to... Oh, I do have to kill the, that. Let's use a meteor on it. To -equip. I can't have any uh, elements on this. Whoops. I don't believe it will resurrect the CPU. You can only heal it. Yep. Good stuff, good stuff. Alright. And that is that fight. And of course, we saw you still being a waste of space. I should have knocked him out, actually. It's done. The giant stopped moving. You. It's Golbez. How dare you meddle in this? You. You're. Can you not speak, old man? Do, do you not even know your true self? My true self? Awaken! Hadouken! <sighs> no. Why? Why was I so consumed by hate? You regained your senses then. Do you do you remember your father's name? My father. His name was Kluya. Kluya. Brother, <laughs> Edge. You were being manipulated by the all-powerful will of Zemus. Your Lunarian blood rendered you an easy target for his curse and bound your thoughts to his. To think Gloria's sons would be made to fight one another. Uh. chose to control our roles might just as well have been reversed no there was evil long before this what i'm the one who abandoned you Cecilia, you did wonderfully, my love. He's a healthy little boy. Indeed, a gift from the gods. Theodore. Hmm. We'll call him Theodore. It's a boy's name. It means a gift of the gods. Theodore, that's a fine name. His life will be a blessed one. Yawn. <laughs> oh. Anyways. That's with this voice acting bit. What if I just go outside? And see my daddy do stuff. There's no denying your... Oh, that's not the daddy. Granted his convenience, he gave us magic and the means by which to sail the skies. Yeah, yeah, that's part of the lore from before. Let's go to somebody else's house. If this knowledge continues to spread, some kingdom will inevitably employ it to rage war. It is unfortunate, but such is the way of men. Yes, sir. People can't settle differences, so they uh, decide just to fight it out. <laughs> it's we who use magic properly who look like the fools. Daddy? You're watching them again, aren't you? Oh, Theodore. You really like them, don't you? The moons. Yes, I do. Why? I'll explain it someday. 
when you're old enough to understand. I am old enough. I can even use magic already. Have you mastered cure? Well, not yet, but... Then you still some things to learn, haven't you? Come, it's late. You should be in bed. Alright. Going to bed. Back to bed. Not back to bed. Oh, mom. What's wrong? Mother. Mother, what's the matter? Don't, don't worry. I'll be fine. But your face is so pale. That's because I've been working very hard. What do you mean? I have to make sure this little one will be alright. Who? Your little brother or sister. I'm going to have one? Yes. Yay, I'm going to be a big brother. Yes. <laughs> so you had best go to sleep now, hadn't you? An elder brother needs to be set a good example. Alright. Good night. A little brother or a sister. Gluya, father. It was the ones who disagreed with his teachings. They they used magic. Cluya didn't even raise the uh, blah 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 blah. <laughs> Cluya did not even raise his arm in his own defense. The door. Father, are you alright? Was I mistaken? Of course not. You can't choose how people use what you teach them. Thank you, Theodore. <laughs> no. No. Hold your stuff together, Cecilia. Cure. Oh, you need more than cure. You need some rays up in here. Cure. Theodore. No. No. Wah, wah, wah. It's a boy. I have a brother. Please let, let me hold him. You mustn't strain yourself, Cecilia. Please. Well, I mean, you don't have to sit up. You can kind of just... Chill. Thank goodness. Mother? Mother? She knew the rest of this birth and st she still went through with it. A vile thing, isn't he? That brother of yours. What? Zemus. He is the root of all you've suffered. Who, who's there? If it weren't for him, your mother and father would both still be alive. No, you're wrong. And you are a vile little insect, birthed from womb of dragon- what? <laughs> Stop talking, man. I name you Golbez. <laughs> That's possession right there. Is that? Oh, he left it at the uh, people of Baron. What is an infant doing in a place like this? What is it? He appears to have been abandoned, Your Majesty. The poor child. What is it, my liege? Cecilia, Your Majesty? Forgive me, I am thinking over much, and yet the resemblance is striking. The child's features, they remind me much of a person forced from Baron because of my cowardice. Interesting. When our father died, I was left behind with my or our mother, who still bore you within her room. The other villagers cared for us at least or at first. The person our father had blessed with lunar secrets. But our mother had become too frail and died shortly after you were born. I blamed you, telling myself our mother would have lived were it not for you. 
I took you, still an infant, to the forest at the edge of Baron and left you there. After that, I took to the borderlands. <laughs> Why don't you just voice act the whole thing? From others' eyes. Racked by guilt, ashamed to show my face. I wore this helmet. To ask for your forgiveness now, but I am glad that you survived. Seamus have possibly chosen that this this to put an end to all of this to the moon is a lunarian as am I I will go with you might as well because you're wasting my party stealing all my experience Cecil Cecil This isn't good. Cecil. Back to the transports. We need to get the hell out of here. But how? This way. Kane. We fall on for enough of your tricks. We can talk later, but if you want to live, you best follow me now. Quickly. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Imagine we actually had to fight that thing. I don't know. <laughs> There's like no way, probably. That's why we fought the computer inside of it. My mind is my own again. True. I cannot expect forgiveness. But... Forgiveness? It's your fault the giant appeared in the first place. Stop it! <laughs> Rosa. It's true though. Colbez broke free as well. That's why you're free. That's also true. It's because he uh, probably hated Cecil. So you're Cecil. Isn't he? I think Kane is the king's real son, and Cecil's the adopted one. Who are you? I'm Kane. Kane Highwind. My father. Oh, I guess not. I take it back. <laughs> My father is Sir Richard Hyland, the commander of the Dragoons. Pleased to meet you. Don't think you can be friends with me just because the king treats you like you're special. What did you say? Wanna fight, do you? What's a soft spoiled little boy like you going to do to me? I'm not spoiled. Don't back to me, will ya? Stop it. Rosa. Oh. Childhood, uh, three way triangle love, something, something. Men of Baron fight not without just cause. That's what His Majesty taught us, isn't it? But he's the one who. Dragoons don't make excuses. <laughs> I know that. I started it. You're an honest one, aren't you? See, it wasn't my fault. <laughs> I guess it wasn't. <laughs> Little childhood friends. What do you mean? Colbez is Cecil's older brother. A Lunarian named Zeus was making use of Colbez's Lunarian blood as a means to control him. Colbez and Crusoya went to the moon to put an end to Zenus. Colbez was Cecil's brother? Well, brother. In case. It would seem I have a debt to repay Zemus too. Huh. And when he takes over your mind again, what then? If that should happen, kill me without a second thought. Finish me. <laughs> then count me in too. I have a couple of blades with the Zemus' name on them. <laughs> Edge. Edge. Let's go. To the moon. To the moon! But Rosa and Rydia stay behind. Uh. This time. 
There may be no homecoming. Cecil, you can't mean that. <laughs> Go. Get off, Get off this shit. <laughs> I was like, well, damn. No, we need them to heal us and do all the DPS. Because you guys are garbage. Can't tank. <laughs> uh, dang. Cecil. Cecil. So we need spellcasters. What are you talking about? Talking about. Talking about. I also need to save. Yes. I can't menu. It's okay. This is it. It's go time. So I'm gonna get off and save. Well, <laughs> surprise! Obviously, they're not just gonna run away. Step aside, Rosa. I'm not going anywhere. Why not? Without me along, who will heal you? Bingo. Rosa. You can't win this one, assassin. <laughs> This battle is ours as much as anyone. Cecil said so himself. And having some idolons along can't hurt, can it? Rydia. You got that right. That's pretty much how we got here. <laughs> like, without the, all these summons, we have not been able to do all this. We're healed, right? Oh, Kane's still like. Oh, he doesn't have magic. That's why he's blanked out. Uh, oh, he came back with a better spear, I think. Mm, I think this ogre killer is better. I think axes in general are better. Mm. Yeah, let's keep it. Oh, he has Genji stuff. Interesting. Go ahead and hit that save. Don't want to do all that over again. 